Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with Jaspie's Lucky 7 box football mixer. Pick your team number one. And we're giving away this Amari Cooper autographed football. So at the end of the break, I'll take everybody's names, randomize them at the end of the break, and the name on top. We'll get this nice football right here. Very cool, right? Perfect for all of you Cowboys fans in this break. Or even if you hate the Cowboys, you can sell it to someone who loves the Cowboys. See? Works out. And this is... I know we, we, we got some jokes. Did did Amari Cooper drop that ball? No, that's only Raiders edition of Amari. That's, that's Cowboys edition of Amari Cooper. All right, there you go. There's the list right here. Good luck to everybody. Stephen K really wants that football. Who's in this break for the football? I guess most of you have to be. Vikings... Last Spot Mojo for Jake Ledford. There's everyone else. Thanks, everybody. Good luck. Um, where should we start? What do I want to do first? Let's go, let's go with the oldest box here, and that would be 2014. Totally certified football. Oh, Sammy Watkins on the front. You guys remember this? Man. All right, good luck, everyone. Um, nothing is sold out after this. I know there has been some uh, some momentum with um, that briefcase of flawless baseball, which is down to seventeen. So we can definitely do that. We definitely have time for that after this. Otherwise, we got pre-orders available for tomorrow select basketball, which should be. Really fun. And encased football, you can pre-order that, and that drops on Friday. We got Mike Evans. Rookie roll call. Relic. Buccaneers, that'll be for Chad B. On the board with a rookie Mike Evans relic. And three out of 25, Chris Borland, rookie autograph for the Niners. I'm going to go to Leonard. So there have been crazy rumors flying around about trading that guy for, for who knows. There's Jimmy Garoppolo, gold, and Dante Moncrief, jersey and auto. Rookie jersey and auto. Nice one for the Colts. That'll be for Ryan Redman. And that's, uh, that's gold rookie Garoppolo. 24 out of 25. Nate Washington. Certified Fabrics for the Titans. That'll be for Arthur Hackett. All right, now let's. That was 2014. Now let's go to 2016. 2016. Absolute retail. I think it's like retail premium edition. It might be the official name. Did Chris Borland only play one year? Ryan Sullivan says one year more than all of us combined in the chat. Well, speak for yourself, Ryan. Speak for yourself, Ryan. I don't, know if you, I don't know if you know, but I played in the NFL for a little bit, a couple years. A little bit longer than that. You can't really tell from the camera, but I'm, I'm actually, uh, I'm actually Heinz Ward. I didn't really want to. I want to build a business on my own, not off. I didn't want to trade off my my success as a wide receiver for the Pittsburgh Steelers for many years. 
Rook Inc. Malik Collins. Cowboys. That'll go to Alan Murdoch. There's Rook Force, Rookie Force to Marcus Robinson, D-Rob. Oh, there you go. I should have gone with that kid. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I don't think there have been any Korean Americans that have played in, in in the NFL. But it was that 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 kicker. Remember that Chargers kicker who was pretty decent in college, I think, but was just, you know, it was just awful in the NFL. Heinz Ward is half Korean. All right. Um, what's the next year we can do? What about this year right here? Nice. Could be some nice stuff in here. Yeah, what? Ku or Ko was his last was his last name something like that. I think there, like that that one sort of that week one bad kick. I think just kind of derailed it, and then he just got shook, and then that was it. It happens. I mean, it's, it's the National Football League. It's not supposed to be easy. We'll randomize this. Uh, so we'll uh, when we do the randomizer, we'll do the randomizer. Name on top. We'll get the uh, the football. Right? And then the second name will get any and all points that may pop out of here. All right, we got Cole Beasley, Elusive Inc. For the Cowboys. That'll go to Alan Murdoch. We got Nate Sudfeld, 41 out of 50 for the Redskins. Patrick K. Sudfeld's still on the Redskins? He's not, right? What are the Redskins going to do? I heard people thinking. Josh Rosen, maybe, to the Redskins? Poor Alex Smith. Probably not going to be back for a little while. Jersey and Otto, Farrell Cooper. Nice Farrell Cooper for the Rams. Garrett Strauss with the Rams. I don't know. But this is going to be... It's it's the silly season, ladies and gentlemen. Silly season for the next... Until through the draft, basically. Um, so that was 2016. Let's go to 2017, absolutely. And then we'll do the 2018s. But silly season. All the GMs are, are, are lying, smokes, mirrors, deflections. You know, they don't want to give away what team, you know, what player they're, they might be drafting or looking at. It's going to be crazy. It's going to be like, oh, the Raiders shopping around Derek Carr. Maybe they're not. I don't know. You know, maybe they're trying to, trying to fool some teams into into giving up some of their trade leverage or maybe, maybe, maybe oh, you know, going too big on a trade. And there's Cooper Cup. So Farrow Cooper and then Cooper Cup. 162 out of 299. Farrow Cooper Cup for Garrett and the Rams. There you go, Garrett. There's Staubach to 100. We're giving away the Cowboys edition of Amari Cooper, his autograph, right here at the end of the break. Yeah, those two, those two aren't bad. Cooper Cup, I feel like, if you look at the numbers, ladies and gentlemen, Cooper Cup on the Rams made such a difference in that offense, believe it or not, I mean I'm, not, I'm saying that he's not the only reason why they lost the Super Bowl, but it did miss him down the stretch, especially Phil McConkey, 11 out of 25, absolute ink. I don't remember that. I don't remember this guy. Brandon Luger with the New York Football Giants. We've got I know this guy, Dan Marino. I've heard of him. 11 out of 25 tools of the trade. 
Wow. Game used material. Yeah, this that knit part right there does look 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 like there's some turf or some dirt on there. Nice Dan Marino for Jeremy Anderson and the Dolphins. Dan the man. Dolphins could be looking for. They got a new coach down there. Miami could be looking for a new quarterback. They can move on from Ryan Tannehill. So I feel like this offseason is going to be kind of fun, actually. A lot, a lot of, there should be a lot of movement. Whoa, Earl Campbell, absolute ink. I've heard of this guy, 91 out of 99. Oilers, of course, turned into the Titans. Arthur Hackett with the Tennessee Titans. Love the big shoulder pads from back in the day. Nice. And for the Cowboys, 35 out of 175, Air Raid Relic for Allen and the boys. All right, now let's go into 2018. We'll do the uh, elite draft picks. Remember those, the uh, non-pro uniform rules apply, as, as you know from all of our previous mixers. And then we'll do the 2018 Contenders Optic, which we have inner case breaks of. Pick your teams on jazbeescasebreaks.com. And we'll close out with the, the one in case card from Panini 1. All right. Good luck, everybody. Uh, I would love to do... I would love to do some flawless baseball. I only see two orders coming in, and I know there's a big new release tomorrow. And we're really in the last two hours of the broadcast. But all that being said, I feel like we could at least do one more break tonight. We may call it a little bit early, too, because I know people are going to be starting to be like, ah, I'm going to wait till tomorrow. You know, I'll, I'll sit on my wallets until tomorrow. I want to get into that select basketball tomorrow, which you can pre-order now if you'd like. But we've got plenty of time to fill that flawless baseball. I mean, really, that's the only break that's, that seems to be getting any kind of attention uh, today. We, did, we already did two briefcases today, and then we posted another briefcase from a fresh case, and that's already, that's already down to 17. It's almost halfway there. A couple of the big teams, I think, are gone, too. All right, let me just double-check this list really quick. Yeah, Angels and Yankees already sold out. Those are the two big teams. So, and Braves. So I guess the after that, I guess it would be Red Sox, Astros, Dodgers are, are like the next few expensive teams that are left. But if there's, if there's movement on it, the high rollers will step up and pick up those teams. So, maybe Kevin Manning would be in on the flawless baseball. Kevin Crouch, what's going on? Forgot about the break credit. And the, good man, look at this. I like that, Kevin Crouch. Kevin Crouch joined the break without even thinking about that break credit. He just joined it because it was a good break. And then ended up being rewarded with a nice surprise email with some break credit. There you go, man. And you got a spot in the random team break for tomorrow night. Excellent. Thank you, sir. Yeah, we should, be, we should have a lot of fun with that select basketball tomorrow. There you go. You're, you're a pro, Ryan Sullivan. Ryan's like, I'm going to snag a team. In flaws, but not going to say which. All right, Azim Victor. Sounds like a he sounds like a buccaneer to me, Azim Victor. Azim Victor is a linebacker for the Orlando Apollos, but he was last associated with. With the Seahawks. I think we pulled this guy before. (laughs) 
Rick Barker said, got the Astros. So he wasn't even waiting for other people to buy spots. He just went ahead and did it. He, he gone and done it. Let's knock it out. Joe Babcock, what's going on? We got MJ Stewart. Wait, I know where MJ Stewart goes. He's a... Uh, is he a Panther? No, that's DJ Moore. Jaguar? But, oh, he's the Buccaneer. All right, all right. I got the right coast. Yeah, the, you start seeing some of the same people in this. It just it just throws me when when like, you know, they're not in their uniform, the not in their pro uniform. So my brain sees like a color scheme. It's like, and then it just goes all wacko. Rasheem Green, Jaguar? No, that's Rashad Green. Rasheem Green, the Green Machine. Is a is a Seahawk as well, so that'll go to Josh Rodriguez. So those first. Wait, no, this doesn't go. This goes to sorry, the last team Azim was he was drafted by the Raiders but then waived and the Buccaneers got him then released then the last pro team associated with was, was the Seahawks Rasheem Green is on the Seahawks currently for reals and then this that one goes to the Buccaneers Chad B with the Bucks. I just want to make sure we got everything squared away for these guys not that they're, yeah, but. And we got Khalid Hill. Oh, come on. We pulled this guy before. I should remember this guy. I just keep thinking of D DJ Khaled. Is he a Seahawk too? Khalid Hill. No, not the Khalid of Saudi Arabia. No, we've looked this guy up before. Oh, he's a Seahawk too. You just Josh Rodriguez, you're just crushing it in this elite. Watch one of those guys are gonna, one of those guys are gonna turn into like a Hall of Famer, and there'll be like a someone will pull this video and be like, "Remember when Joe was making fun of that guy, saying who the hell is this guy?" And then he ended up being a Hall of Famer. It's gonna happen. One of these days, it's gonna. I'm prepared for it mentally. I'm prepared for it. I'm gonna make fun of Trayvon Young and be like, "Who the hell is this guy?" And he's gonna turn out to be a Hall of Famer. Um, he is a uh, Los Angeles Ram. It's going to happen. Remember when, uh, I don't know how many Aaron Judge cards there were out there, but the year before his full season, first full season, I mean, he was essentially... Remember this? Like 2016? September 2016? He was garbage. He hit like 160-something. And there were Yankees fans in the offseason saying, hey, let's get rid of this guy. <laughs> let's trade him. Let's trade him for a bucket of baseballs and, a, you know, a bucket of double yum bubble gum. Trey Marshall is a Denver Bronco. Safety for the Broncos. That goes to Stephen Kay, who's also reporting... That flawless baseball is down to 14. Nice. That's the beauty of the hobby, though, folks. That's a, And that's a pro tip for um, when these kind of products start coming out in the middle of the summer, after the draft, and after the rookie premiere, you'll start to see um, a lot of these early football products come out. 
my advice, just hold on to him. You know? All right. Good luck. Like I said, we got um, a master case, two inner case breaks from a master case posted on uh, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We can do those tonight if you'd like. All right, triple threat out of 99. Falcons, Bulldog fan, Will with that one. Alex Smith. And behind Tom Brady is Kenny Young to 199 for the Ravens. Brent. Your sticker auto is for the Saints, Boston Scott. That'll be for Stephen K. And your on-card auto in here behind TB12, that's not numbered, is Mike White, rookie ticket auto for the Cowboys, Alan Murdoch. Good luck. Last box in this seven box. Well, Jaspi's lucky seven box football mixer. Figure team one. Remember at the end of the break, we're going to randomize everybody's names. Someone's going to get that autographed football. And the second name will get the 250 points. Try not to look at the card. Okay. Good luck, everybody. It's going to be, bam. Wow. One out of three quad relic and on-card autograph Big Ben Roethlisberger. Steel Curtain, who picked his Steelers. They were sitting there for a little bit, too. One out of three quad relic and on-card autograph out of Panini. One. And that's a nice one for Michael Gallucci. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. All right, now let's see who uh, let's see who gets this. I think it's questionable, Rick Barker. All right, everybody has a shot at it. Let's roll the dice. And let's randomize that list six and a five, 11 times. Name on top gets the football after 11 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and 11. Then final time. Name on top. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, Clay, you'll get the points. One, Jake Ledford. Look at that. Autographed Amari Cooper football coming your way. There you go. Congrats, sir. There it is with his cowboy stuff on there. Pretty cool design right here, too. Awesome. And there you go. Congrats. You're welcome. Congrats. Thanks for getting in. Thanks, everybody. That was Jaspie's. Lucky 7, Box Football Mixer. Pick your team number one. This is Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And we will see you next time. Bye-bye.